What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jay. We are going against our homie Shaquaza, coach of the Dallas Starmers, aka Shaquaza the Button Clicker. And he's a good homie of ours. Uh, very funny guy. Make sure to go check him out. Link in the description, as well as all the other IC coaches. But we're, we're facing them in semis. We did do a meme match, thankfully, so none of our like real ass tech was revealed. Um, but we're here. I'm super nervous. We know each other six because we traded beforehand. We're gonna click A right here and get right into it. Um, I forgot to take my headphones off because I was in call with the homies and you know manners because I didn't want to hear the echo or the, I don't want them to hear the echo. But oh well, I guess we're gonna do headphones and I'm not gonna hear anything. Cool. Fine. <laughs> Exogor, Ensign, Zydog, Zatu, Magnezone, and Grap Locked. Um, if I'm being honest, right now, uh, Scyther does look like a really good lead. Um, I don't know if Exelgor suicide lead with final gambit will that take me out? It will take me out. Uh, I don't want to lose my Scyther, it's pretty important. Um, if I'm being honest, like, Drapion doesn't look too bad off rip. Uh, what will Togor not kill me? That's what that's the game we're gonna play. It just kills everything, so, um, huh. Weird. Did I just leave last place, bro? I do not know. I think I do. I think I just lead Blastoise. See what happens. It's not a bad lead. If he leaves Magnezone, that's like an easy switch. Um, anything else kind of covered, aside from like Zatu maybe. But even then, if he's like teleport, then we'll just see what happens. Because he'll get a free Zydog because he's going to know we're going to go on like Drapion, but that's fine. Um, but we'll see. We shall see, bro. This is gonna be this is gonna be an interesting one. Very nervous, very nervous, very nervous, very nervous. Um, he comes with the boot strip, the Tims, Jason Litton. Nice. Okay, so we straight up come right into here. Um, he might knock us off. Um, I could. He has to intimidate off. That's fine. Good far off a scald. Cause who do you go into on this? Uh, don't really know. I assume maybe you go Zatu or Magnezone, potentially. I think I'm just gonna flip turn. Uh, if he, I mean, if he knocks us off, he knocks us off. Uh, cause if uh, nice. So we get a free flip turn right here. Tech deck. Who is that? Is that this thing? Okay, cool. So it's okay. I think what we it's Rocky Helmet. Okay, nice. Good to know. We've got some info. It was a bulkier set, I guess. Um, we can go out into you. I could U-turn. Um, he has to go hard zone, though, on my dual wing beat. And anything else doesn't really want to take it. So I think I'm just going to click dual wing beat. I'm not going to U-turn. I'm just going to click a button here because I already did a flip turn. So he might stay in thinking I'm going to U-turn because he could take it. I'm just going to straight up dual wing beat. But he doesn't really have a switch on the side for Magnezone. And as I said before, like we just go hard Jolteon on Magnezone every time. So it does withdraw, okay. I'm just gonna opt to hit this thing. Oh, he goes down to Jason Lynn. Okay, that's fine. Intimidate this pop off. We're gonna get some nice chip on this though. Very bulky for sure. Nice, nice. Um, do I think this thing is scarf? I really don't. <laughs> like I don't. Uh, but it does, I mean, we did over half, so we could pick up the KO right here. As long as we land. I think we do pick up the KO. I don't think it's like a risk or anything. Uh, let me see. I throw to a Incineroar. I peep. Because this is like very important to winning this game. Uh, I don't want to take a knock on it, but I don't want to lose this thing. Then you just click it again. I don't think it's Scarf. Oh, it will draw. Okay, so I could have U-turned. That would have been great. Miracles is going to be Magnezone. Okay. Yo, if I U-turn right there, that would have been great. All right. Does nothing. <laughs> does absolutely nothing. Should have probably U-turned, but... Hey, why not go for the KO, bro? Because then indeed he's like super free. Oh, we got to go fast AF, boy. Literally no reason not to. You could double and go Zydog, which I could see Shay doing. But it's like if he sh until he shows it to me, I'm not gonna make that play because it's a little bit, a little risky. 
And I could have U-turned right there, but on the off chance he is Scarf Magnezone. Don't want to risk it. But we do see whatever faster. Alright. Bolt switch comes out. Nice. Hit that Bolt Absorb off. Um, I'm just going to go for a Mud Slap. Drop the accuracy. If he comes in with Zydog, he comes in with Zydog. Nice. Cool. Yeah, he's like AV or Max Videv or something. That did, that did literally nothing. It does, it's supposed to be like 30 to like 35. That does a lot. Body press is going to do a chunk. That yeah, does it quite the chunk. We're going to Mud Slap again. Just do it. He is Videv bulky. So he's like AV probably. Definitely AV with maybe some Spideff investment. Because Jolteon should be doing quite a cute little amount. Do, so maybe we can he can miss one. That'd be great. Maybe he could miss one? Question mark. Body press. Does he land it? He does land it. Okay, cool. Cool. Almost kills us. I'm gonna mud slap again. So I'm okay with this because then we can uh whittle this thing down and then bring in uh like Ooh. He's gonna withdraw this time. Okay. Who do you got into? Emma is going to be this thing. Okay, nice. So he could probably fire up a toxic if he wanted to. If he is a Zydog, like protect sub toxic thousand arrows set to like counter my Tangela. But if he goes for a toxic, his uh, accuracy is lowered. So I'm kind of cool with that. So I'm just gonna go into peeping right now. Clearly going to do it. We see that we're faster, obviously. Does he stay in? Because he could, because I'm at 9%. He might just opt to double and go, Jason. He does. Dang. Yo. Hmm. Tech deck comes out. Um. I kind of want to put this thing to sleep. I think I can put this thing to sleep. Oh, we're faster. And we missed. Cool. Bulks up in my face. Nice. Bro, that's not. Mm, that's so bad. We're gonna sleep powder again. We're faster, which is cool. He has no speed investment. There's not speed creeping our Tangela. But that was kind of unfortunate. <laughs> that was that we missed. Because that would have been great. Because it gave us free momentum into something. Gonna withdraw. Probably gonna go into Zatu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's a Zatu if I've ever seen one. Zatu if I've ever seen one. Not gonna worry about it because you know it doesn't affect us uh he's probably gonna teleport here there's nothing i could do to read that to be honest i could stay in but if i take an air slash it's not a fun time so i'm just gonna go into soul body uh missing that sleep powder right there it was unfortunate it is what it is but i mean i'm pretty sure body press after like minus two was like the same percentage you still eh, like oh, bro u-turn so he's u-turn instead okay nice to know not teleport i wonder why um, nothing claims immediate, I mean, Drape, uh, uh, Zydog does, never mind, I take it back. I was gonna say nothing claims immediate momentum, but Zydog definitely does. Emma comes out, and the thing is, Shay could easily, like, safely make that double. Wait, he took damage. Why did he take damage? Oh, Mud Slap, I was like, wait a minute, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm just gonna swap out right here. And he could make doubles, but, like, kinda in, like, not in a bad spot, we're just in a limbo right now. We're like fighting for momentum right now, which is cool. But like if I had landed that sleep powder, it would be great. Jason Lynn does come out. Um, part of me like wants to um go into Drapion again, take the knock. Um, part of me wants to sack off Jolteon, but then that like allows him to freely click both switch and stuff. Um, Blastoise is literally here for this thing, and judging based off what the Excelgore is doing, I assume that it is like a offensive set, um, and not like a spike set. But I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's offensive if he's gonna save it in the back like how he's been doing. Granted, we've only been playing for like nine minutes, but there's a knock. I could have went back into Drapion, but we don't take too much from that. AV is gone. Uh, do I want to flip turn again? You can't afford to let this thing go down. So I'm just gonna flip turn. Should, uh, I think we're, wait, are we faster? Nah, okay, so cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, I forgot that we're gonna take Rocky Helmet Chip. 
Unfortunate. Yeah, yeah. I think I do the same play. Because if I can sack off Jolteon, that's fine. Because I get in free, I get like free momentum. I'm just gonna do wing beat. At least bulk up Rocky Helmet. Good to know. I'm just gonna do wing beat. I'm not gonna. There's like no reason to think about it. A free but click every time, and Magnuson gets more chip on it, putting in range of like Indeedy and stuff. So I'm down with that. If he does go mag, but we'll see what he wants to do here. Oh, missing that sleep powder was a little unfortunate. Not, I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world because he did switch out anyway. So, but it would have been nice to have this mono sleep. So we're gonna do a wing beat right here. Nice, gonna go down. Gonna take some rocky helmet chip. All right, so we got one mon down. Cool. Um, should probably keep back a little, but I haven't even been paying attention a little bit already. All right, so cool match stats. Scyther. KO grapple lock. Nice. So he maybe thought we were gonna U turn because last time we wing beat it, but this time like it just made sense. Zydog does come out. And the thing is like every like he can use Zydog as bait because like I literally cannot let, let Scyther like go down. Kind of important. Uh, peeping. Oh, cause he could have Stone Edge, and that's the that's the problem. So he's gonna stay in because he is faster. So we'll see what he wants to do here. We might see a toxic. I wouldn't be surprised. If we do. Stone Edge. Okay, there it is. So confirmed. He does have Stone Edge. Ooh, excuse me. All right. So I think what we do right here, we knock off, predicting the Zatu. A hundred percent. Oh, Jason Linton comes out. Nice. Okay, so we're gonna knock off whatever this thing is. Then it comes off. It might be boots. It might be AV. Um, knock off. We'll see what it is. Is it AV? Looks heavy duty boots. Okay, cool. No more item for you. We're gonna go out into Blastoise. If he U turns or parting shots, it is what it is. Literally can't afford to lose EV light and can't afford to like take a flare blitz. Really, I probably actually I probably could if it's not an offense. That he's rest. Hmm. Okay. This is if this was Prep City, bro. You'd be this would be instant forfeit, instant disqualification, instant flag on the play. Um, I think what I want to do, I do want to flip turn again, but I kind of want to scald. What is my blast toy? Am I minus speed? I am minus speed. Oh, that's a speed tie, actually. If he's running, oh, never mind. It's not a speed tie. The calc has instant speed. Um, do I flip turn? Do I scald? I feel like scald is pretty free here. I'm being honest with you. All this pretty free. I'm gonna withdraw. I can get some damage off on something. Miracles comes out. It's this thing. Okay, nice. I'll take some damage on this. To be honest. We're gonna scald. Nice. We get a burn. No burn. Forever not getting burns. We'll go right into Jolteon. Probably die, and that's okay. Oh, he'll probably fire off a body press. But it also could be like mind games right now because I could stay in. I could have fired off my own body press as a mid ground, honestly. But I thought he was going to go Zatu. To be honest, because I feel like Zatu is better because now his ch his walls. I mean, actually, no, instant is still there because he has rest on it, which is smart on his part to have some longevity. So that way, indeed, he doesn't like just go off on it. That's cool. So Jolteon does come in. We'll see what this thing wants to do. Oh, OK. Ops is just bolt switch. Nice. I am down. I am down, I am down, I am down. I will just mud slap again. <laughs> just like, I might as well try to lower the accuracy, right? Might as well. We're gonna mud slap, do some more chip. Accuracy's gonna drop. We might die, probably, we could probably die. Yeah, we do. So, Magnazone. KO Jolteon. And what I wanna do here. I could go into you and just opt to brick break. I could go you. Um, I really want to get a T spike up. Like, for Zydog, it's good. I mean, it, I guess it's not as good anymore because he has two things that, like, Incineroar doesn't care about it now. A grab block is dead. Magnazone doesn't care. Zatu doesn't care. So it doesn't really, it's not really that important anymore. Um, I think I just go into you. What does that allow in? Zatu? I just put Drapion. 
That's fine. Yeah, I'm fine with. It. We should be able to KO from, the, from this range. I, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Scyther two a max zone. Like, just because we know it's like max HP. If it's an iron defense that max defense burke bait does 47 to 56. That's definitely in range. Um, so I'm just gonna opt to burke break here. You know it's not scarf because we saw the switch moves. So just fire off a brick break. Uh, he could go on his Zatu, which would be a pretty good play. All right, so we do kill this thing, nice. And so Magnezone is gone, no longer a threat. So Scyther, KO Magnezone. Nice, 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 nice. So honestly, Scarf and DD right here would have been kind of cool. We're not, we're ring target, and we haven't even gotten a chance to bring it in yet. <laughs> so. Uh, we saw a knockoff from Ensign. Now, um, we haven't seen much much else from it. We've seen knockoff and we've seen who's been rest. So we might be sleep talk with fire move maybe. Spreadsheet. This thing comes out. So he's going to get a free throat spray because he's going to bug buzz. And we have enough uh, HP on Scyther, I believe, to live a hit, I think. So we're gonna go into Excel Gore. Um, now the question is, do I sack off Blastoise here or do I sack off Grape Gun? I think I'm better off sacking off Blastoise. I mean, my ways of dealing with Incineroar become kind of non-existent a little bit. I do that. Grape is kind of expendable, but it's nice for Zati. So, and like Jolteon died. So, I mean, I think I'm fine with going into, like, sacking Blastoise off, because, I mean, I... Uh, I mean, it shouldn't be a problem, because we have Scyther right here. And we have NDD. I think we're fine. I don't think Drapion's that important right now. We're probably going to see a Bug Buzz. Or a U-turn, maybe. I'm going to go Drapion right now. Probably going to see a Throw Spray pop. Oh, we see Spike. Oh no. So he is hazard stack. Okay, 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 okay. Dang. Now, do I wanna, this could be sticky cold. Um, do I get on my own T-Spike? Is that worth anything? I feel like getting damage off on this thing is better. So it might not be offensive actually. You do see bug buzz or you might be expensive with just a spike. All right, we eat that relatively well. He gets the spadef drop. That really stuck. Not throat spray. Okay. Sticky hold. What is it? Lefties? Or is it boots? Probably boots. Oh, bro. That spadef drop is kind of big. Otherwise, we could just pick up a 2 KO right here. Um, I just go for a poison jab. Oh, that bug buzz spadef drop is kind of big. Oh, okay. He lets us kill this for... I don't know why. It's just damage, right? Poison jab. We should be able to pick up the KO right here. Yeah, we do. Cool. Alright, so... Drapion KOs... Um... Excelgore? Maybe thought I'd switch out? I don't know. I thought you'd just pick up the KO right there. Because who do you go? You go into this thing. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Yeah, T spikes would be really nice. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> we just have to figure out how to handle a couple of things. Um, if he goes Ensign. Hmm. I wanna stay in. Do I have any do I I wanna get a T spike up, but is it really that important? I'm like torn. I mean, I'm not scared of what that dog. I mean, like he's he's shown like Stone Edge. That's pretty much it. So we'll see what he wants to do right here. What he wants to do. We're approaching. Wait, is it 30 minutes my camera has or 20? I can't remember. I'm gonna click it now, so we don't have to worry about it. Do take spikes. I'm gonna dragon it to my face. Okay, cool. Outrage will do a chunk. Just kind of scary. Um, now the question is, do I want to sleep powder or do I want a Giga Drain? 
That's the real question. Do I want a sleep powder or do I want a Giga Drain? Because... Uh, I think a Giga Drain. Yeah, Giga Drain. Because I have quick attack on Scyther. Holy skitter schmack. We avoid the attack. I'm sorry about that. Um, Sorry, Shay. I am very sorry about that. Um, I'm not too sorry because I did miss a sleep powder, but I don't know how much Skitter Smack would have done, to be honest. I don't know what plus damage, plus one damage is doing or looking like. It's going to lower my Esp attack. Yeah, it's not doing that much, so it didn't matter too much. I mean, it's for damage rolls. It's going to lower my Esp attack. It's going to have to Giga Drain right here, get some health back. That definitely looks like it's in range of uh, quick attack now. Um, I think I just go for another Giga Drain. Might as well, right? Might as well. Shooter Smacks again. Gonna get less and less health back. So, gonna take some more health out of this. Nice. Um, might kill? I don't, I don't think he'll kill. I don't think it's doing 81 points of damage. Um, do I knock off? I think I just Giga Drain again. Like, why not? We I mean, could save it, I guess. I guess I should have just knocked off just because it probably would kill. All right, so he stays in cool. Does he kill? He does not. So we're just going to gain drain right here. We should pick up the KO. That should be Tangela. KO uh, Zygarde. 10%. I keep wanting to say Zydog, but it doesn't come up as that <laughs> in real life. So, Zygarde. Goes down. Zygarde 10. So cool. That's nice. Um, kind of sitting pretty. I think we just let the Angela go down right now. There's no like point in having it anymore because uh, he only has Zatu and Ensign left. So I think I just knock off right here and then get momentum and go out into Indeedy potentially. Oh, wait, do I go in? Nah, because go oh, Indeedy because he would U turn. So I think that's the play. Um, I think I'm just going to Swole Body. I think I would die from a hit. Yeah, we just go Swole Body. So we shouldn't die to any one hit from this thing. U turn probably will do maybe a little bit. It'll tickle. Shouldn't do too much though. Instant is still a threat though. Oh my god. It's kind of scary. Um, we already knocked. I think just Poison Jab right here. Try to get a Poison. Uh, him, I feel like he'd swap out. Yeah, nice. So we'll just P Jab this thing. Just P jab, P jab, P jab. That's what we do. Is he intimidate? I guess I could have doubled right there. I kind of, I should have just doubled. That was kind of silly. There's a little bit. Uh, I should have doubled into Blastoise right there. To be honest, we'll go Blastoise. Um, I don't think we have any like any chip on Zatu at all. Kind of problematic. We're gonna take some spikes damage here. That's a lot. That's the sleep. We'll see if he sleep talk or not. He is sleep talk. I hope he gets like rest, and not knock off. That'd be great to get rid of these spikes. Fire punch. Nice. So we should live this. Cool. 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 Now I just fire off a rapid spin right here. Get rid of these little hazards. Um, of course, like some skull damage would be nice, but it's fine. Yeah, he's just gonna withdraw. So we get rid of these hazards, cool, which is cool. I mean, if it's in no speed, Zatu, we might out speed. I don't know. I wasn't really speed creeping that. Got some chip on it now. Is it Rocky Helmet as well? Is it not Rocky Helmet? Let's just see for the fun of it. Do we have speed? We might. Uh, Hold up. I don't think we do. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. Oh, we might. We actually might. So we just fire off a fat scald right here. So he's running some speed. He's indeed running some speed. So Blastoise does go down. So Zatu, KO, Blastoise. Um, coming a close game right now. Um, if this thing is defensive, Zatu. Uh, Scyther, seventy to eighty-four. So not enough. I could go in DD. But is I guess it would be worth, right? 
If I go in DD right here, he probably U-turns. Oh, but if we're faster, then it's not worth, right? I can just hyper voice, right? Because I'm trying to debate if it's worth tricking or not. Definitely feel like it's not worth tricking. He'll probably U-turn right here. We'll just hyper voice. Yeah, he stays in. Do that. Nice damage. U turn. So that's fine. Because we'll kill next time. Oh, we just go hard Drapion now. He's had one turn of sleep, I believe. Then it comes off. Yep. Um, I would ring target, but there's no like there's no point right now, to be honest. We just go slow body. We just go slow body, slow body, not slow body, slow body. Cause like uh wait, is no it's not. I was about to say, is Zatu Scarf, but then we just saw air slash into like U turn Alright, have we? I don't know. Question mark. Uh oh. We see a knock, we see a fire punch. So it's gonna do a chunk. Not too much. There's a chunk though. Decent little chunk. Um, we will poison jab. Just to get as much damage as possible on this thing. Nice. Jason Lin woke up. Fire punch comes off again. Do not die. Which is it's not the worst thing in the world. Because like if he opts to kill us here, we just come in with a. Uh, Scyther and we kind of win. Oh, it's not Scarf. We just saw that Ndidi has fed. I'm silly. Well, why do I? I think the worst <laughs> scenario is possible. We do get the poison, but I don't think that's going to matter because he's probably going to rest right here. Yeah, there it is. We're just smart. So, Scyther to a Incineroar, which seems like to be max HP. It's 50 to 59. Uh,. Why have I been poison jabbing? What am I doing? What? Dog. What am I doing? I'm gonna brick break. Why did I not do that before? I just got like tunnel vision. Wow. Please get rest. Forgive me for my sins. Please. Please, 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 please. Just knock off. I think that's gonna kill. Oh wait, no, it's not. I have 32. Let's go! Let's go, baby! So psychic terrain is gone. Do I wanna brick break again? I don't think I really ha I don't think I have to predict him going into that too. Cause then that's a free Scyther. Yeah, cool. So we'll be able to do this. I hope he kills us now. Cause then we can uh go right on to Scyther. Please, please hit me now. Please don't get rest now. Please get like fire punch or knock off. Please, please, please. Nice. Thank you, game. Thank you, game. Now all we have to do is hit a um so he has two turns of sleep. Just gotta go on the Scyther. Oh wait, Intimidate's off. Intimidate's off. Yeah, 75 to 89. Okay, cool. On the Scyther. And then click the wing beat. That's our only play. This is a close one. The good Incineroar set. Really good. The wing beat. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Here we go. Nice. So we do KO. That, which is great. Scyther's gonna be able to pick up the KO on uh, Incineroar. Uh, I wasn't paying attention to the KOs now. Oh well, YOLO. And we should pick up the KO on this. And that should be the game. Which was a very good one. That Incineroar set was very, very good. The Wing Beat, we do land very nice. And that's gonna be GG to our boy, Shake. Quaza. Very, I hate, I hate going against the homies, especially in games like this, but it's also very fun, but it was, it was really good. It, it was, it was a good game. It was a good game. So GG to Shay, make sure to go check him out in the description, as I said before, as well as all the other ICP coaches. Um, I do know who I play in finals, um, but I won't, won't tell you guys cause you know, leave it a surprise. Uh, but, um, it was the winner of the Mario B versus Kurt, just Kurt game. So make sure to go check them out as well. Make sure to go check out their sides. Those battles will go up on Sunday, but. If you guys like this video, make sure to leave a thumbs up down below. Also, if you guys are new and want more of this content, make sure to click subscribe and click that ringing bell. So that way you guys know when I post. Without further ado, I'm your boy Jay. I'm going to get about your hair and I'll catch you all next time. Bye.